<laughs> Who said that you can't go back to school in your 70s? Who said that you can't have a baby in your 40s? Who said that you can't start a rap career in your late 30s? Who said that you can't buy a house in your 50s? Who said that? Huh? I know you're not listening to a motherfucker who got swole ankles telling you that you're too old to do something. And I know you're not listening to a motherfucker who got scoliosis in the back. They can't even lift themselves up straight. And I know you're not listening to a motherfucker with bad credit. Credit so bad, they can't even get approved for a finger hut account. And I know you're not listening to a bad teeth having motherfucker. Mouth look like a whole mouth of wisdom teeth. Huh? That's who you're going to listen to? That's who's going to dictate what you should do? You're going to listen to them. The motherfucker who wife ain't stunning them. The motherfucker who husband don't even exist. That's who you listen to? That's who can control what you do. As long as you are alive, there's life to be living. Go do you. Go follow your dreams. Don't listen to them motherfuckers. Because I'm going to tell you this. The same people who hate on you, critiquing what you do, ain't going to be the one that support you anyway. They ain't going to buy your product. They ain't going to come to your house. They ain't going to congratulate you or nothing. Do what you want to do. Don't listen to no motherfucker tell you what you should do. Why you gonna listen to a motherfucker telling you what to do when they breath smells like doo doo? Drop the intro. Do it for the hood folk. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up, hood folk? This is Jeremy. And this is the cameraman, Rashad. I like that for you, man. See, I'm supporting you. Who said that you can't be a cameraman at 36? And who said you can't be a microwave at 36? <laughs> Let me press that button. So, hello, folks, today is Monday morning as we make this video. And I told y'all on yesterday's video that if you take them old grits, you don't have to throw them away. So, it's Monday morning. Rashad, like, what are we going to eat? I got a good idea. Let me make you some breakfast. I hear folks, I just got these out the refrigerator and y'all can see. I hear folks, I just got these out the refrigerator and y'all can see this is cold. Look at that. These are cold grits. Cold. Okay. So, these are cold. Now I'm finna show you that you don't have to throw your grits away. Put on my heat. Boom. Alright. I'm gonna pour a little bit more sweet milk in here. Well, I grew up calling this sweet milk. 2% milk, 1%. You know it's so funny that they sold out of 1% milk. Every time I be buying, well, was trying to get 2%, it was sold out 2%. Now they sold out the damn 1%. But anyway, this 2% milk, and all I got to do is turn my grits. See how cold they are? Boy, get down in here. Get down in here good. Who he barking at this early in the morning? I got my grits on low. You can see they cold. Can you see they like scrummy eggs? Mm -hmm. <laughs> like mashed potatoes. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to put them on low, cover them up, and let them do their thing all over again. One day by my baby, it don't matter if she black or white. That alone should have told y'all, counsel. Counsel, counsel, uh-uh, counsel. Uh-uh. Anyway, we got some brown eggs, white eggs. Ooh, do I see some shells in there? What's the difference between white eggs and brown eggs? I don't know. I, I really don't know what the difference is. I see a shell. I see a shell. I got to get that damn shell out of there. Because they never more nasty than... Mm-mm. I'll leave it there. Y'all got to get that shell. Give me a minute. Let me go fishing. All right, a splash of milk. Then a little bit of seasoning salt. And then... A little bit of black pepper. This black pepper is dedicated to Mr. Fred. Y'all know Mr. Fred? The story about Mr. Fred. I never want to hear that story again. Damn story got me. Oh, that's why I'm going to OCD now. PTSD. DDT. I don't even know what the hell I'm saying. Shit, BBD. BB wine. You know BB wine is there for a beat a bitch ass wine. You know BB. Put them hands on that woman. <laughs> 
<laughs> we ain't even gonna get on BB. I seen some recent videos and BB in good shape to be 65 years old. Shit, I'm jealous. Well, no, I'm not jealous. That's the wrong word because I ain't jealous of nobody. Well, I mean, you gotta be in good shape in order to beat a bitch ass. <laughs> BB. <laughs> <laughs> now that is over. There's no more use for guns and wars. Because I got me some fences. To <laughs> what the hell is a fences? Two hands, two fences. <laughs> that pants. Ooh. Kids, this is your brains on crack. Kids, don't eat your brains. <laughs> what the hell? I hear folks, weird as this may sound, I don't like cheese in my grits, hard as that may sound, but ironically, I like to put just a little bit of cheese in the eggs. That's about it. And I don't like my eggs hard. I like my eggs right after al dente. Al dente? That's just for noodles. <laughs> hey, al dente is for everything. But yeah. anyway, I like my eggs with cheese in it. But the way me and Jeremy make eggs is totally different. Yeah, I like my eggs to be a little runny. Because I like to put cheese in my eggs while after I done mixed all the seasoning with them. Because I don't really put too much seasoning. Because when I put my egg, I mean my cheese inside my egg before I start cooking them, you know, that's that's the seasoning right there. I just put a little pepper and that's it. Y'all know I used to love devil eggs so much. Oh, I see everybody now. They, everybody's so sanctified. They don't call it devil eggs no more. It's angel eggs. Anyway. But I used to like devil eggs so much. But something recently, well not recently, but something changed my soul and I can't even eat eggs like that no more. Only reason I can tolerate these eggs here because they scrambled up. All right, that's it. That's how I like my egg right here. This is this how I like my egg, just like that, just like that. Off the fire they go. They done to me. All right, here, folks. So here we go, my grit. Look at my grits. Now, if you got a little lumps in them, just get your wire whisk. You see that? Day old grits, ready to be eaten again. Still creamy, still good, seasoned like a mother father. Now let me build you a little bowl, Rashad. See, this how I like my bacon like this. Crunchy. Whoa, what the light's doing? Turn out the light, damn. Teddy, get the fuck out of here, Teddy, damn. Teddy Pendergrass turn on the lights. What the hell is Teddy doing here? <laughs> Shit. Well, I guess you're going to be lighting some candles. I know. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh. Who want a breakfast bowl? You know, this is supposed to be breakfast. Ain't it breakfast? But we say breakfast. Ain't no damn K in breakfast. It's breakfast bowl. Who want a breakfast bowl? Then. Get you a couple of these little eggs right here. That's enough? Mm, a little bit more. I don't want it but a little. There you go. And then you swing that bit back over here. Then you put your little piece of. Look at that. Oh my God. Look at that, that breakfast so bowl. Good. All right, so this was Shard Bowl. His little breakfast bowl. And this is mine. I eat my bowl just like this. I don't stir mine in. I am. I'm, I gotta stop putting y'all on to stuff because I be doing too much free promotion. Y'all, this right here is so good. I only eat it on breakfast stuff, and I put a little of this on like that, and that's it. That's mine. How you gonna do yours? Huh? Crystals. Just like that, and then I stir it in. Hmm. Show, now let's see the difference now. Show them the difference. <laughs> Y'all see how different we are? That's disgusting. That looks amazing. 
Boom. And, and that's how he and that's how you do your yogurt too. I do my yogurt the same way. I mix my yogurt up when I get the uh yogurt with the fruit. I mix it in and eat it like that. So so who folks, how do, how would you eat your breakfast bowl? Like mine's or like ears. Let's go talk. Look at him. Where his food at? Where your breakfast at? Look at him. Look at him like he done worked all night. Get it. Get it. Look at him. Look at him. That's all he want to do. Eat, 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 eat. I hear for so I got a couple of little grapes. Green grapes are the best to me. I like green grapes. Green grapes make your tummy shake. I hope not. Well, they really do. Uh, now, so, oh my bad. What you mean to say? I was just about to say I ain't got on no shirt. That's cool. They can't see but your bow, big bow head ass. <laughs> Oh, uh, now see, tasting these grits with that hot sauce on it. Now this is how it's supposed to taste. Mmm. Taste, don't taste good. It's good. Best with this crystal. Yeah, that crystal is my favorite on regular, but on breakfast, cause I don't eat breakfast, y'all know that. Like that, I don't eat it that much. But when I eat like eggs, I like that, that oh, what is it called? Sriracha I showed y'all, that is so good on eggs, especially when you do them breakfast wraps. I love putting it in my wraps, because it gives it that kick to it. Because that sriracha is kind of hot. It's not hot, hot. You think so? It's not hot, hot, but it's kind of hot. But it's good. It's a good hot. It's not like a hot, like, oh, God, I got to tolerate this. Who was that at your front door? <laughs> Damn, who was that? Amazon. Oh, <laughs> now look at that. The ring didn't even go off. <laughs> Amazon just left here. The ring didn't even go off at all. But watch this. Watch it. Keep talking to him. Keep talking to him. But yeah, so, um, but yeah, y'all know me. I love my breakfast. No. Let's listen. Look at that. See what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? That's why. Look at that. Look at that. See what I'm saying? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Rain. I need to get a reboot. Let me wash my hands. Keep talking, babe. But yeah, so um, so today, this morning so far, I've been a good morning. I got up earlier than I normally would on a Monday. But I did get some good sleep last night. But I told him, I said, I text him last night, I say, hey, I want me a breakfast bowl in the morning. Man, I got me a breakfast bowl. But uh, y'all know me, I love breakfast. I wanted me some damn pancakes or some waffles or some French toast sticks. I might get that, I might make it. I might make me that tomorrow morning, maybe. But. I love me some breakfast. And this breakfast bowl, every time I um every time he makes it, whenever he makes it, I kill it. I don't, I don't leave none left. No crumbs left behind. Mm -hmm. So today is Monday. What are you doing today? <laughs> gym. Well, going to the gym. That hurt. I'm gonna walk this mud. You couldn't have the oranges all in the screen. I'm gonna walk this mutt and then um I think the yards need to be cut. I'm sleep. <laughs> you gonna mow the yard? I'm sleep, man. I need a haircut. So I'm getting my hair cut Wednesday. I wanna address one thing, a topic that we not a topic, a comment that we get often. And I say a lot. A lot. When we I know I said we was at Wendy's. 
And I said when we was at the chicken place where you got the two catfish and I had the wings. Mm -hmm. And I think I said we had the other went to this other chicken place. I have allergies extremely bad. My ear itch all the time, my eye itch all the time, my throat itch all the time. My doctor got me some nasal spray I put in my nose. I got some eye drops that drip in my eye. And my eyes are always crying and leaking. It is so funny that I had met somebody one day at Kroger. I was at Kroger. And she had said, hey, what's up, hood folk? And I was like, huh? At the time she saw me, my eyes started leaking. I was like, damn, this woman going to think I'm crying and I'm sad. <laughs> but, y'all, my eyes leak a lot. So if you see me making videos, even when I, even when you look at the intro of this video, I was realize when I had my head turned, I had to drop a tear right here on my eye. Like, damn, and I just see it. So that we got to do editing out the video. Yeah. If you see anything in my eye, it ain't that I got a dirty face or he need to wash his face, his face. My face is clean before each video. I make sure I wash my face with soap and water. Things that I can be proud of with myself is I make sure the kitchen in this house is clean most of the time. The bathroom is clean most of the time. And my balls are fresh 90% of the time unless I am exercising. These balls are always fresh. You can li lift one up like this. You can lift one up like this and you can take the second one. And you can see back them balls, they is fresh. Now you might have some baby powder on your mouth, but you know, it ain't gonna kill you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the hell wrong with <laughs> but, So yeah, I hate when y'all be talking about, ooh, Jeremy need to wash his face. Now I can tell y'all something about me. I'm like a I'm I'm like a manly man. You'll see me go out and I'll cut grass. I'll be sweaty as a mf -er. A motherfucker, I should say. But anyway, I go out there, I get dirty. My nails, I be having dirt in my nails from doing different things because I'm a manly man. And that's what I do. I do manly things. Like if I could change my oil uh my oil, if I can change my oil in my car, in my truck, then I would, um, I'll do it. But it's just like I don't have the proper tools as far as like how, lifting the truck up and and draining the pan and all that kind of stuff. So I just need to get the right tools. But hey, I can do that myself too. You know what would be funny though? Change the oil, let all that oil run out in the drain. <laughs> Hey, people in the community, they be mowing their yard and blowing the leaves and trash that and drain, so a little all ain't gonna hurt now. <laughs> it's all, uh, it's, it's a lot of stuff in this Houston um, sewage drainage anyway, so. But you know, if you was to change your oil and let all that oil run out in the drain, somebody from the home association and the city gonna be over here and write you out a ticket, probably put you in jail. Yo, when these people be blowing all them leaves and trash out in the drain, ain't nobody saying now. All mouths are closed. Oh, also, is it just me? I've been talking to people, you know, online and that I know personally. People are saying that it's hard for them to find a job. Like, finding a job is so hard. Like, I'm, people are saying they're putting in 80 and 90 applications per week. No callback. No nothing. And these are people with degrees or been or trained in this field, can't find no job. Even in this city, we're supposed to be a black city. Nope. Jaws are not coming good in this city either. All right, so, um, but yeah, and what I've noticed just because of me being uh, in uh, management and doing hiring and things like that, it's just like service jobs. Uh, uh, a housekeeper. Uh, a valet driver. What else? Working as a waiter in restaurants. You know, just the, just those kind of jobs that are really going, you know, hit you up and reach out to you. But that's a lot of people don't want to do anything like that because it's just like um, it don't pay enough. Let's just put it like that. It doesn't pay enough. And a lot of people say that uh, things in this place is affordable. Uh, it's affordable. This affordable that. But it's not. It's, it, things are expensive. Apartments are expensive. Car insurance is expensive. Health insurance is expensive. Gas is uh, reasonable. <laughs> Gas is expensive. Um, food is expensive. We so, get the point. Go to the motherfucking point. But yeah, so you know that's a lot of things. A lot of what I see. A lot of people they they getting you know two or three jobs and they be these uh, you know 
low wage jobs that you know they got to work three of them just to be able to make ends meet. So, um, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know what what's going on. Why, why we, you know, it, the things is like it is, but we can change it as a people. We can change it. We just gotta get together and do it. Yeah, I, I agree. Ooh, it's hot. It's hot. I'm full. See, I'm good. I usually eat all my bacon, and I'm probably get it to the dog. <laughs> I'm still going. You ate all your. Oh, oh you mix your stuff up together. <clears throat> See, that's what make it good when you mix it up. You get all of the, you incorporate all the things inside of the bowl. So you won't be, you know, getting one side and one side won't have, you know, bacon. You won't get the other side and then it just has uh, bacon but no egg. So I got all of it mixed in and incorporated. All I do is just scoop down and pick up everything in one time. And same here. I scoop down and pick up everything in one time. <laughs> just mixed. <laughs> mm. You're wasting stuff. You're going to be vacuuming. Eat I got a vacuum. You do. A Dyson right here. That motherfucker suck up everything on the boat. I was talking about boss. Carver Oh, yeah. That's another vacuum, too. Anyway, y'all, that's all we got for today. Uh, shout out. Oh, my God. What's wrong with that dog? Playing with his toy, trying to get it to beat, uh, make that chirping noise. This dog got a toy. And we play with the little toy, and it, it make a little squeaky sound. They get on my nerves. But when it don't make the squeaky sound, he get the whine unless somebody's stabbing a knife in his heart. Like, man, man. It's hot. Yeah, we talking about you. We are talking about you. So we hope to put up, we got to, we going to do a challenge. Y'all, we got a funny challenge that we going to do. The go, that video is going to go on Wednesday. It's going to be fun. You think it'll be fun? I know it's going to be funny. Yeah, so we got a challenge that we're going to do Wednesday. It's going to be no eating and no cooking, but it's going to be a challenge. And then Friday, we're going to do another video. And then Sunday, we have another video. So that's how this week, weekly schedule is going to go for videos for us. Today is Monday. Shout out to all the people who like Monday. Am I the only person that's not tripping on Monday? Monday is honest in life. Most people hate Monday. Oh, I can't stand Monday. I actually like Monday. My least favorite day of the week is actually Sunday. I do not like Sunday. I remember being a little boy at church and I never liked the Sunday. Even when I was little, like 19. But this, I remember being a little boy and being at church one time and this woman was preaching mm -hmm, I can't wait to get to heaven where every day gonna be Sunday. And I remember looking at my sister and I said, oh my God, I hope not. I want to go to hell so I can be a Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> my mama was so, and I said it so loud, my mama was so mad. I'm telling you, if I could have, if she was Michael Miles, I would be sitting up here like this. Hey, what's up, little folks? I ain't got a head. She would have took my whole head off my body. Because Sunday is, to me, Sunday is a depressing day. It's, it's like the end. I found out, it seemed like when I, back in Bama, everybody would go out on Saturday night and have fun. And we go to bed Saturday night is a goodbye. Wake up Sunday morning. Oh, oh, such and such died in the car accident last night. Such and such got killed at the club. Like, it was always sad that somebody died the Sunday morning. And even when I found out my daddy died, it was a Sunday morning. Mm -mm, I don't like Sunday. I cannot. I promise you, I wish I could sleep through. I do not like Sunday. I'll take Monday in a day over Sunday. I can't stand Sunday. I don't like Sunday. Yeah, Monday is the start of a new. Because you're starting a new week. Yeah. Being able to change what happened next week and you know, and hoping that this week be better. So exactly. Yeah. Whew. Well look folks, we is through talking. I'm full. I really am full. When I say I'm full, I'm full. And then I know some people think when the camera cut off, I still eat y'all. I don't know where y'all I don't know what y'all think about me. I don't give a fuck what you think about me. But if I was gonna eat on this camera, I would sit here and eat. And all I would keep eating his air. That's all he eats. Right. Oh, cool. I'm I'm really content now. When I we I'm gonna go ahead and edit out this video, and then I'm gonna go walking. And I think you do walking, then I'm gonna eat something else. Then I got some grapes, some more grapes in there that I gotta figure out what we're gonna eat for dinner. And you know, like that. So, mm, 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 mm. oh, make some potato salad and put grapes in it. All right, here we go. Like, comment, subscribe, and press that ugly ass bell button to get notified whenever we put up new content on this page. 
who that be? Hood folk. Who we are? Hood folk. Who we do it for? Do it for the hood folk. Who that be? Hood folk. Who we are? Hood folk. Who we do it for? Do it for the hood folk. Do it for the hood folks. 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 Yeah, yeah.